Greetings fellow scavengers, welcome back to Duskers Daily Challenge for July 2nd, 2020 where I got pushed up, pushed down from the top 10 leaderboard to the people lacking unofficial patch and they got extra points thanks to that, presumably from ship scan or extra drone HP but uh, if they were to get extra drone HP, they would only get uh, 30 points extra from it if they were to have like uh, very very maximum drone HP so yeah congratulations to uh, the top 10 as you can see from the screen and then something that shocked me is that apparently it's possible to have a tie with someone because Renegade hello man that was cool in some way and because my friends purchased the game earlier they got pushed down into even 40 place out of 91 players 9 more players and we got 100 players wonder if it's possible to reach them damn that's like the most player that I could see in the daily challenges But you can say finally because uh, yesterday was kind of free for all kind of uh, mission as well. You just get to kill the leaper and then the rest of the ship is pretty much empty basically. So we got the root power and transporter for the uh, installation upgrades for the day and lure for the scary upgrade with 330 for the HP in total. Um, all of them can, can take a leaper hit to the face, thankfully. Recruitly at HP with unknown amount of infestation types, good hull integrity, and stable age. Um, at best we can get one or two infestation type, but at worst we can get three. I'm just gonna, yeah, transport my way in already. Wait, not one. Oops. Bit of a do that. All right. Next generator. Fuel access. No slime. Nice. One jump cell. Gets you 20 points of damage. Wait, no damage. 20 points. I guess I can start from here. Ooh, D2, D2, D2. Vent. Hmm, not much. Not much to see as of yet. I'm gonna assume. First, just gonna power this generator. I'm just pretty sure that it will power that. But once we power this, oh, oh, hey, oh, hey, um, yeah, I need you. I was thinking, well, sure. <laughs> All right, you know what? Yeah, we're just doing this first thing. Alright, uh, yeah. Alright, so. Before the fence bonds. Let's get up into two and then drop this thing again. Good. Yeah. 
We've got any panic mode here. I don't wanna lose any of the rooms. Still suck if that's gonna happen. Hmm. Okay. Bro, come here. Or not. Alright. Wow, only one of the Um, this room has the next. Uh, has a not toggle ship upgrade. Bargain. All right. Can hit that. Hmm. It's okay. I'm done with this ship anyway. Basically comes down to when that transporter at room 11 will appear basically. Want to get the turret. We could kill the leaper if we want to but kind of not, not, not really needing it to anyway. So from what I know about transporter signal in the patch player, it will appear at the same time with the other patch players as well. That's what I can think of, but it will disappear and reappear at the already appeared uh, signal at different times. That's kind of what I can get. Also, we have a bit of a discussion in the daily challenge right now where uh, we were talking about why probes semicolon pickup cannot work. Um, I'm just gonna... And it will cause you this dead turn right here. But for some reason, if you want to... Vacuum a room by, for example, typing A3 and A3, it will work and it will vacuum the infestation to space and your turn will be safe from that said vacuum instead of you typing this and then enter and then typing that again kind of makes you wonder how they work to be exact as jury mentioned in the daily challenge desk discord come on room 11 I'm waiting for you it really comes down to whoever types room 11 the fastest uh, wait, uh whoever types exit the fastest they will be the one who get the faster score in this whole derelict basically. Except if other players got it, got the room 11 signal fast enough, which of course that's thanks to the game's RNG and all that stuff. So yeah, that's m the best score that you can get in the mission. Uh, that doesn't count if you have higher turn HP and such and such. I just want to end the same as LB, but still playing, so good luck LB. 909.